What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I bring you another Destiny 2 video and today I want to discuss furthermore the Forsaken Combat Reveal stream and some of the changes being noticed post stream which are causing a riot. Basically we have now seen a hand cannon capable of killing opponents in PvP in around 0.6 seconds. Crazy, I know people. But before we go any further, if you'd like to show your support to the channel, hitting the like button truly does help me out and I do appreciate that support. Also stay tuned until the end of the video to find out about my controller giveaway. Okay, so with the Forsaken Combat of your stream, we saw many new changes come to the game. A deeper mod system, master work changes, and a drastic time to kill change. What's happened is basically because of the new weapon loadout system and you've been able to rock three shotguns in PvP, to counter this and basically not let every other weapon fall under the radar, to keep things balanced and that a variety of weapons are still going to be used in PvP, Bungie have buffed precision damage across the board. Exact values are not yet known but I believe it's between a 1 6th and 1 8th damage buff, but only from precision shots. This way countering someone charging towards you with three shotguns won't be too difficult if you can aim for the face. This change has allowed many things to come into play, more so than I believe Bungie may have thought about. 390 round per minute pulse rifle rules such as the Magnum Shepherd, the Duran 7 and so forth were almost too burst you. 600 round per minute auto rifles would drain your health much like the Prometheus Lens did with its bug. And we are yet to see the craziness in action called the Gravity Lance with this buff. Also guys with many mods in the game helping all areas of the weapon, random rolls being a thing too, and the masterworks also, I truly believe if the direction PvP is heading, time to kill will never have been as fast as it will be. I'm excited actually. But I know for an absolute fact there will be much complaints from the community, I guarantee it. The time to kill with proof in this video is within a blink of an eye. So within the stream the other day we got eyes on a hand cannon called the Lunas Howl. This is a unique legendary weapon with its main perk being called the Magnificent Howl. So I'm guessing this perk may be exclusive to this weapon or a group of weapons this gun belongs to. The hand cannons also are part of the fastest firing hand cannons in the game, the 180 rounds per minute class. Now to see how fast this thing can shoot and is capable of shooting, we see the West of Sun 47 on screen now. This is of the same class of hand cannons. Putting this out my vault and shooting with it, uh, as I haven't used this weapon since I got it, I can tell you it feels a heck of a lot quicker than the Better Devils and my personal favourite, the Dire Promise. The Lunas Howl being used in the gameplay you'll see in a second, it has an 8 drop frame, Zen Moment, Magnificent Howl and an added mod called Target and Adjuster which basically improves target acquisition. We also see its masterwork has been added to the stability giving it a 10% buff here. So when we see this in action, although the user isn't the best player, we see something remarkable. This weapon 3 taps and kills in literally half a second, I think it's 0.61 seconds to be exact. What's actually happening is, the Magnificent Howl perk is kicking in, allowing extra damage to be applied to the third shot after hitting I believe 2 precision shots. So it's basically kill clip without the reloading part. And this is on a weapon of the fastest firing hand cannons in the game. Think about that for a second. How are Bungie going to allow a hand cannon to kill at semi-decent range in half a second? I'm actually pretty sure this is their intent also. And this is actually a hand cannon we don't see with any range stats because range finder is coming back. And also Masterwork can add 10% to that range on hand cannons too. As we saw with the Better Devils on the Combat of Your Stream. This Magnificent Howl perk is new with the Forsaken, I'm guessing many new perks will be added to the game too and it's crazy to think how fast the actual fastest time to kill weapon in the game will kill. This reminds me a lot of the last word when it was capable of killing this quick, Bungie were quick to nerf it, now it seems the fast time to kill is what they want. I mean I know we all wanted a faster time to kill, we wanted it faster than what we currently have, but did we want it this quick? I ain't sure people, we won't find out until September 4th when we can actually get and play test these weapons ourselves. What we actually might be seeing here people is when I actually think about it, this may be the new Redrix Claymore. This indeed could be the Season 4 Glow Rank 3 weapon or maybe even Rank 4 or 5. I'd actually put money on that because if it isn't then damn we are in for some fun. But this Lunar's Howl looks absolutely crazy, a part of the fastest firing hand cannons in the game capable of free tapping. I mean where does this end? 
I cannot wait to find out. But on that note, guys, we have come to the end of the video. I just wanted to express my feelings on this crazy find. I'm excited to find out more. Are you? Let me know your thoughts on this down below within that comment section, people. And before we end, every month I give away a fully customizable controller for either Xbox or PlayStation sent anywhere in the world. To be in with a chance to win it, simply drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below, make sure you are subscribed to the channel, and follow the Gleam link at the top of the video description. It's fast, simple, and legit, guys. But on that note, I am out. Thanks as always for stopping by, and hopefully I will see you on that next one.